The NHL is facing pushback over a new policy banning pride tape on hockey sticks. It follows a league-wide overhaul outlawing any themed apparel. New tonight, WCCL's Jason Rantula spoke with a local queer hockey club about what they would like to see done. Having that sense of community really for us is being with people that are safe, inclusive. Camden Danick Bennett and Danny Bennett Danick founded the Twin Cities Queer Hockey Association two years ago as somewhere, they say, for everyone to have a safe and inclusive place to skate. As a, someone who's born female walking into a co-ed locker room um, or a pickup, guys don't necessarily want you on the ice. The league has already expanded from one and a half to six teams. The last two strongholds of homophobia in the sporting community is hockey and football. The two say that stronghold was demonstrated over the summer when the NHL announced a ban on theme night apparel like the pride themed warm-ups worn on team pride nights. They say that stronghold was once again reinforced last week when the league announced rainbow colored pride tape was also banned. The kids that are the most important, you know, they have NHL stars that there are their idols. They, they start playing hockey because of those idols and to not be able to see that they're supported on the ice um, is really hard. Despite the ban on theme night gear, a Minnesota Wild spokesperson says they are still hosting Pride Night March 12th and that they support the Pride community year round. Both Danik Bennett and Bennett Danik say the Wild, who sponsor their league, has gone above and beyond helping fund their ice time and gear. Their ask now is for the team and league to show support by bringing back pride jerseys and stick tape. We'll bring back the tape, that's very important, and the jerseys, um, and keep moving forward, not, not going backwards. Jason Rantala, WCCO News. After that backlash, the NHL Network reports the league is now reconsidering and may allow players to show some kind of support for nonprofits and other inclusion efforts like pride.